Hey guys, Uncle O may be here, bringing you a guide to the Utgard Pinnacle to get the blue proto drake. It's going to be juicy, it's going to be fresh. You're going to want to set your stuff to heroic. Got to do it in heroic because it doesn't drop in normal. And you're going to... If you've been in here, I don't know why you would. You could reset your instances. I mean, I don't know why you would. But maybe you have serious problems. You never know. So, hop in. Get your load on. Hopefully your, your RAM is set up so that it can load this. Or internet connection, you know. Don't know too much about what's going on. Well, let's just hope it's RAM. You know, who knows. So then you're gonna say hi to him. Not really, don't worry about it. Uh, buff yourself up to whatever buffs you're using. I'm a pally, so I'm just gonna be a pro, you know? And heal, and bubble, and then heal to full with one click, and then bubble, and then heal again. Oh wait, and then I'm gonna bubble, and then when you get me to all the way down and you're gonna execute me as a warrior, I'm gonna bubble. So anyway, you're gonna hop in. You're gonna hop in the Utgard Pinnacle. And you're just gonna sail on through, right through here, right in the middle. Now you're gonna hop up on this. Fuck that skeleton, get far away from him. He has herpes, you don't want anything to do with him. It's dirty, just stay away. All right, so you're gonna hop down this part. Now for some of you kids who have serious issues, you might want to listen closely to this part. You can get raffle stomped, and I have seen it happen to many kids in the past. What are you going to do? Now, Seers heal. Seers. Dragon Flare Seers. They heal. The other Tards, they don't do anything. But you see this guy walking down here? He just patrols back and forth. Now, if you choose to fight him while the four of them are here, you're going to have to take four on one time. And for most of us, that's not a problem. You know, a pally, no problem. But for those hunters, <laughs> just kidding. For those other kids, you might, you know, might need some help. So, if you can, if you can CC, I would CC the seer, and then pull the rest. So, just pull the rest, walk back here a little bit, because you don't want to, like, end up pulling that big smelly abomination or whatever it is so just down these guys with your elite skills get all pvp on them and start moving and whatnot like you know what you're doing because that's how you play wow you just move and know what you're doing and just spam buttons as you see you got ain't got no add-ons no type add-ons still killing them still killing them dragon seers so now you're going to pull this guy, but he, she's going to be a bitch, and she's going to start casting. So run to here, and you'll pull her over. There you go. Pull her over, and you're going to kill her first. Because if you don't kill her first, she'll heal her ass, and that ain't no good. Oh, heal. Interrupt the heals if you know how. And that, well, if you know how. If your class permits it and interrupt the broad and then down the uh, the last fellow with the long ass beard alright so now you're gonna hop up on this thing and just walk past the delicious oh god I thought that said delicious hulk anyway you're gonna walk past him and then you're gonna wanna do the same thing you're gonna CC the broad because she heals she's one of them priests you don't wanna deal with one of them priests in BGs that just bubbles her ass off. And you get them down to low health. And you go to finish them. And no. Nope. Nope. So you're going to kill them. Put on your pally bubbles if you got them. Just kidding. You don't need to. I don't know what the hell. Oh, look. But she also heals. Look. It's like a BG. What am I doing? Oh, God. So she also heals her mates over here, her man, her pimps. She heals her barbaric pimps over here, so you're going to want to try and kill her first and not pull her like I did by accident. 
So heal yourself up a little if you're low, you know. You know the deal, it's not your first time. If it is your first time, you probably hack someone and you should probably turn yourself in. Because that guy's probably quatting his ass off that you took his level 99 warlock with full gilded retardation raid gear. So you're gonna hop up those things and get hop that delicious, lovely looking thing over there. Just forget about him. Oh, guess what? Guess what you're gonna do? CC the broad, that's right. Oh, but look, this time you got two broads. So there's not much you can do on this, except pop some cooldowns maybe and finish her faster. So she, if you find this difficult, hmm, I don't know. You might want to get yourself checked out for problems, you know. I've heard many people have problems, my myself not being one. But I do know a kid named Steven who has a certain problem, such as this. Poor child. Just, he just, it's just, he's horrible at every game. I don't know what it is. Alright, so heal yourself up if you really want to. If not, you know, fuck off. So, you're gonna walk through that? You just did that. Good job. Now, here's a boss, but you don't have to fight her. So you can just chill, relax, grab some popcorn, listen to her talk, or don't, because she says nothing important, or nothing you'd ever want to hear. She just basically comes over the over the talk to uh, the dude she's talking to. I, I don't really remember who she's talking to. But doesn't matter now. Because you're just going to dance with this guy. Like it's PvP. Dance. Just dance with this ugly fuck. Mm. Look at that juicy stomach. He's been working out. You can tell. The sensation is orgasmic. That's what she says. I mean, is that really necessary? I mean, I really do have a problem with these kids who made this game. I mean, I like the game and all. And I'm sincerely into it. Because my faggot friends got me addicted to it. But whatever. Anyway. I mean. Like, you'll just be doing a quest. In Howling 4 that has nothing to do with anything and just saving the world and then all of a sudden you get a quest to steal eagle babies and harvest them in your anus i mean i don't understand what there is to do but you know they come up with these things when they're high i don't i don't know but you know it's not mine they're they're rich i'm not they win so we're just gonna let it, we're gonna let it fly all right so i didn't even talk about that Anyway, you're going to want to make sure you don't pull these guys down at the bottom or anywhere around there because you're going to pull the rest of the mob and that's just a pain in the ass. So make sure they're up the steps and then just walk through and don't pull them. And you're, If you have a CC, you just CC the last guy back there because he's a archer. So you're just going to... I mean, he's a shit hunter. That's what he is. I'm sorry I said archer. Shit hunter. So anyway... Um, you're going to want to down these fellows, just, it makes it easier on yourself, so you don't die, especially if you're a class that can't, uh, be pro, and just, like, full heal with one button, like a pally, as myself, because I'm not even full geared, and I'm just doing work, just doing work, I just dinged to 85, you know, but this actually is my only account, because I just started playing, mm, that's okay. So if you're not healed, I mean, heal yourself by God, but you don't need to. Kill this little guy. He's now this part, you might need to pay attention. Let him walk. Let him walk by. Now you're going to get on the wall, okay? Just just act like, act like you're getting patted down. Hop on that wall. The cops are here to arrest you. Hop on the wall. Spread spread them legs and just hope you don't have some really messed up cop that's just gonna touch your sack okay you just you just wanna relax take a gander as soon as they go by lick this donkey balls whatever that is hop on through continue on let's get it now that's the mount you're gonna be wanting to get his name's not gonna be Groth 
but I mean if you have a if you have a certain syndrome you might want to name him Groff I don't I don't know and you're gonna be having to kill Skady because he's got scabies or something he's really pissed off see and you're just gonna run through here now make sure you're buffed up you're healed because this is gonna be an AoE fight for the century oh look at that bubble if you can throw some AoEs down now when you're killing these guys you're gonna have to make sure you watch your health so you're gonna watch your health and at the same time you're gonna watch the things that pop up on the screen so just talked about the harpoon launchers which is nothing but you're gonna have to kill I would kill all these guys I kill them all now you see when he says he takes a deep breath you're gonna watch it where he shoots his his uh, cow semen and you're just gonna move away from that so it's gonna it's gonna freeze you up and you're not gonna have a good time okay guys so you're gonna move away from that you're gonna you're gonna down these certain fellows now what you're what you're looking for at this part is harpoons so I'm pretty sure the harpooners would have a harpoon up oh, look at that pick them harpoons up now you're gonna need the harpoons so just keep picking them up on your way keep killing don't don't ever try to light the things on fire oh look at that Chav's calling me like he knows me. Come on, Darren Collins. Oh, let's get it. He'll probably call me 12 more times just knowing him. He's got a serious pro. <laughs> this is one of the kids I'm talking about, guys. Serious issues. If you want. See, now it's in range. So now you're going to want to use. Oh, my heavenly Jesus. Make sure you're living because you're going to get ready to fight a boss as soon as you do this. Now, I'm going to bubble so then bags don't do it because I'm pro like that okay, so there you go so now pop your cooldowns finish them don't pop bubbles yet if you have bubbles don't pop them yet I'll show you when to pop them. now pop because now you're just going to break your bags and not your phone now watch your phone because anytime you'll beat not your pal you know just cheat and throw your up so now you can just kill these kids like it's a good old day at the farm. Farmer Dolson shotgun. There we go. Fighting like Swifty. Let's get it. The mount. Oh, oh no. Oh no. And that's what you're going to ignore. Yeah, that's where it's happening most of the time. So anyway, he's just the boss you're going to have to kill. Uh, that's all you got to do, really. So you're just going to, to get out of here, walk, kill the rest. If you really, if you have that much of a problem to kill him, go ahead. Uh, kill. You can do that once a day. You're going to want to do it once a day if you want a blue, blue proto drake. I have yet to get it. I've done it, you know, for two weeks or so. So you're going to just make sure you do it all the time if you really want it. And uh, I'm sure you're going to get it. I've seen many kids with them. So I have no doubt you can get it. The drop percent is 1.6. I do believe maybe 1.8 if I'm wrong, which I most likely am. But yeah, I mean, just do that, get it in every day, prosper, be like an Uncle O maybe, just get it in every day, you know, throw down some dances when you're done, you know, and if you uh, if you guys want some other gills by O Mabes, just let me know, maybe me and my uh, Chav friends will help us out, uh, we're, go we're gonna be doing some BGs on here, I know that, some arena, it's gonna be funny. It's gonna be fun. Stick around, comments, like, dislike, tell us what I did wrong. It all helps. So enjoy your day. Please do. For those of us with illnesses, you're gonna need to lay down, take some aspirin, think about it. Okay? You're gonna wanna get well. Because you ain't gonna be doing good in this game unless you're well. Just that's not at all true because no one on this game's well, but that's okay because it's all fun and games. See you next time.